Welcome plungers. Thanks for pulling up and tapping in again. So here we are back in my little bedroom. With a little update. And as you can see there, it's some painting. So yeah, I got this room painted because it was better. And I got this stimberries planted. And I got myself a Beazle Buffo named Beetlejuice. Level 80. But he's a little bit better than Jalen. Jalen does a little more attack damage per hit, but he hits faster. And as you can see, I did quite a bit of decorating down here as well. And I've been doing some breeding. So truth be told, I breeded a bunch of spinos. Like I don't, I don't have them here because I destroyed the eggs or whatever. But I've, I've breeded a bunch of spinos with very little luck. However, I have been breeding Dinosuchus. I'm just with uh, some success. So this is, I just breeded this one, her, and I just breeded him together. So we're gonna go find out real quick what the tame is gonna look like. I've put him in this dino box. And let's see. So we've got five mutation stacks on each side, two into melee, two into health. And it seems to have reasonable colors. Uh, oh, fully imprinted. He's an adult now. Let's see what he looks like. So yeah, this is the adult, which can take 12 more levels. Put six here, and let's put six into melee. There's gonna be frame rate issues and all of that because uh, there's a lot of stuff. There are a lot of assets here. So let's get to the crux of this video. So I realized that I did not have a taming pen or a platform for my aviaries. If you remember the last episode, you'll remember that the door was here. Now it is here to accommodate the new feature that I've built. And I, I tend to go big. So we've got this taming pen here. So I could take my flyers and I don't have to drop them in from the top. I could fly in from the side and just drop them in here. And from here, I have the ability to long neck rifle them or whatever. And then we'll make our way around to the other side, which is the only way to the top of the platform. This isn't the only way to get to this access. But since I'm out here, I figured I might as well. Oh yeah, and I also put these little doors with the ladders there. So you could easily make your way down from any angle to get the tame for if it's a creature that has a, a fast torpidity rate, that wouldn't be too good. So, let's get this guy in here. Let's get the store closed. Let's get this elevator called. I think it's coming down. Yep, it's coming down from the top. It also goes down to that lobby level there. I might put another level in here because all of this empty space kind of bothers me. This is a dangerous group. 
So yeah, I might put a level in like right here or something, uh, maybe with some guy. storage or something. But here we are at the top with my two Ketzels. One with a platform that has yet to be built on and the other who has a level up to accomplish 59 levels for this one. And I think I already leveled this one up. So this one is uh, level 109. But what I'm going to do, since he's a little, she, I keep doing that. Since Jill is a little bit faster than the Ketzels, I will take Jill so we can get up here for the aerial view. Because now the stick man is on an E unicycle. I tried to make the roof like that, so it looked like more of a wheel, so yeah. And he's got a little paddle in his hand or something, I don't know. I'm just scratching I don't know. But yeah, he's definitely a stick figure guy, stick man. So let's make our way back over here. Close the door and try to squeeze in. Okay, we made it. Okay, let's see. So this Sarko is not as OP as his predecessors, even though he is leveling up rather quickly. For example, his mother has a 62,000 um, health. 62,000. The most tankiest creature that I have. But uh, I think I'm going to try to build the Dino Sukus saddle. If I don't have to do it in the smithy, I will do it here. Oh, nope. Probably got to do it in the smithy. So I've got two. I've got the, the automated arc one, and I've got the regular Degola. Let's see. Oh, okay. And what do I need? Uh, Smithy. Okay, here we go. Dino Sukus. Can I not? That's the Smithy, right? Let's see, let's see. Oh, it's gonna be so hard to find it in here. Why can't I just. Why can't I just find it, man? Didn't I unlock it? I could have sworn I unlocked it. Oh, no, I didn't. There we go. Now that that's unlocked. No, I gotta search for it over here. And I can craft it. I've got more than enough supplies for all of that. So let's get this out and let's get it on this guy. I'm going to throw his parents back out there and see if I can get another magnificent tame for him. But it is what it is. So let's get over here. Let's get into the swamp before it gets too dark because it seems like the sun is going down. So let's see what kind of kills we can get real quick. And at some point, maybe get a better saddle for this guy. I mean, ideally, I might just want to wait until he's a little bit stronger. Oh, 
Oh, we can't see anything with these. Alright. Alright, that's better. I do want to get some Isties. I got one. Level 130 something. But I don't want to kill any itsies. And as you can see, I pumped more into my oxygen <laughs> than anything else. I think. I think I put more attributes into oxygen than anything else. Um, let's find some land. And land. And see what this dino supers can do. Fully imprinted and all that good stuff. Let's see what kind of damage we looking at here. I see nothing to attack. It's got to be something. These things are painfully slow when they're walking. Not quite as fast as a Sarko underwater. Oh yeah, has anybody, uh, has anybody seen this? Why can't I not go in here with my tank? That's the thing that bothers me. And now I'm stuck. I can't go in there with my tames, but I can go in there myself. Okay, something to munch on here. Let's try, let's try a regular bite. Oh, wow. Let's try this, uh, this charged up bite, this gigabyte. Let's try it. Oh, this is an alpha something, Mothasaur. Oh, Boston. 1200 damage. So I'm not, I'm not gonna lose this. Definitely not. Even with my little bit of health. My health is low. But this thing is not gonna do. Let's do a gigabyte. Oh, 8,000 damage. Wow. So let's uh, make quick work of this. Because this thing is not even getting bloody. It's not even getting bloody. Oh, yes, it is now. Yeah, it is now. Let's do one more gigabyte. Did I miss it? Did I miss it? Oh, no. Alpha Mothasaur. So yeah, that was that was good. And now I'm drowning. Come on, let's let's get up there before I die. Okay, so that was pretty good. I mean, the, I, if I had full health, it wouldn't have been nothing. Brought me down to maybe 7,000, which is exceptional. So I will be pumping some into... I will definitely be pumping some into stamina, because... Losing my stamina like that was not cool. And now I might as well feed him. Yeah, you, you earned all this prime, buddy. Enjoy. Enjoy. Let's see if I could just get him out of the red. Because the flashing red is annoying. Maybe just go in with the fish meat too. All right. All right. 
right. Mm-hmm. He's good. And now we back on our speed again. So yeah. Really, really strong. Does a very decent amount of damage. Wait a minute, do I have my... Yeah, I've got uh, Jira active. My Dinosuchus has some levels, so when we get back to the base, we'll level him up. Him? Yes, him. Well, we'll level him up. And we are, yeah, we're going away from that base, but we've got yeah. bases everywhere, so we'll just hit up this one, man. I need you. I need you to hate me, so I can use you for your energy. Level our guy up. Yeah, the, the stamina really drops fast. Yeah, the stamina drops fast. So I'm going to level up the stamina, definitely. Because we've got more adventures to go on with this guy. Well, actually, not really. This guy's for breeding purposes only. So his great grandchildren will likely be the ones that we will be using. And if I could find another gorgeous color to add in. I'll take it. Because his grandfather is the one I just found chilling on the beach and I happened to have two pieces of kibble on me so it was like literally the easiest tame I ever saw. I turned around and he was already basking. Ready. 36 levels y'all. So we're going to put 12. Twelve there, twelve into melee. Uh, seven into stamina and five into movements. Because I really want this guy to be a little bit faster. But yep, that's about it. And just like that, I picked up everything he got. That's the thing I love about this new. Uh, Dino management system. The compost pile should have definitely picked that up also, but that's all I got for you guys. So thank you for tapping in, and I'll see you in the next one. Oh my goodness, I didn't even pick up the Griffin. I have no flyers on me right now. Do I? Oh yeah, I got flyers on me. I'm bugging. See, I, I did keep this one cryo because... I definitely needed, you know, like restoring all these RGs would have been like problematic. So I do have a flyer to get up out of here with. But yeah, that's all I got for you guys for now. So thanks for tapping in. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace. And it's a baby.